Hi, this is Tim from Bricksmart Workshop. If you build Technic models or Technic-based MOCs in Studio, you may have noticed the shock absorbers and pneumatic cylinders are not adjustable. So I've created adjustable V2 pneumatic cylinders and pump, and a range of shock absorbers at different compressions in Part Designer, and uploaded them to my Studio Gallery on Bricklink. There's a similar issue with the linear activators and I've already posted adjustable ones in Bricklink and a separate video about this. So at bricklink.com, head into the studio gallery and search adjustable pneumatic cylinders or adjustable shock absorbers in the miscellaneous section. Download the files and open in studio. With the pneumatic cylinders, you can copy and paste them into your design, release and use the translation tool with fine grid selected to adjust the extension of the shaft and head then recreate the submodel when you're happy with the length. With the shock absorbers, choose the one that is closest to the length or slightly longer than you need, copy and paste it into your own designs, release the submodel and change the color as needed, fine tune the length a little using the translation tool with the fine grid selected and recreate the submodel when you're happy with the length. I have noticed some issues with loss of connectivity and problems rendering when moving these custom parts between computers and users. Hopefully Bricklink's studio development team will get around to adding functionality to these parts soon. But until then, try these. Thanks for watching and do let me know how you get on in the comments. And please give us a big thumbs up if you like the video. Click here if you'd like to see more studio tutorials or here if you'd like to see more studio speed builds. And don't forget to subscribe and click the bell if you'd like to see more videos like these.